<laughs> the hood's gone. What is up, everyone? This is No Cap TV Central. Welcome to part number 18 of the USB Shift. Now, like I said, we're playing the endurance races into separate parts, and this race was very much ridiculously really tough because I suck at it. But much more relaxation once we go to once we race 30 laps of the Dakota Trioval, and we get a bonus, and the bonus stars for drafting points. All right. Let's go, let's go, Speedway action! 10 seconds, that's 10 seconds to green, are you ready to go? How you feeling, alright? 5 seconds to green. green. Oh, we go, just go. bumped into the back of this car for what, whatever reason, because he stopped. Anyway, so with Speedway action, we did a rolling start because this is the cold up track. 30 laps at, uh, the cold up trioval. This is gonna be... This is gonna feel nice. Since we upgrade this car to the max, we, it is most likely a chance that we're gonna win this. It looks like Kumi has just in the way your head. It's almost like a right right here. Oh, that Porsche. Kinda spun that out. On the podium. Need to be careful though, as well. Earn 100 drafting points, yay! I'm in second place right now. Catch up to kill me up. We're gonna lap cars as much as we can, because our cars are, most, are the most powerful. Where's the end of the track reminds me of NASCAR? Why, why does it remind me of NASCAR? Because it's an over track? It's possibly is. It's possibly because of that. It reminds me of NASCAR. Alright, catching up to kill me up is most radical. As we have much more great momentum towards the turns than Ambush King was. I'm taking the way away. Kima is just right behind me. I might just end the. Uh, so much points for overtake. Yes. Still trying to block Kimia if I want to win this race. Let's try to pass these cleanly, so I don't so I don't create a wreck fest. This race could be longer than Amos King was, since we're chopping about like 25 seconds per lap. Seems to be pulling away from Kimi at this point, cause we're one fifth into this race, and we're just gonna distance away from her. Whoa! There's a four car draft, four car single lineup around here. Succeeding. I see smoke. 
I'm very glad that they that they decided to do an endurance race on this. But I might tell you that the next one might be just a total wreck fest. Cause if you didn't if you didn't pause the video, you might know what I'm talking about though. You might I mean you might not know what I'm talking about, but if you did, you would know what I'm talking about. And I'll explain that at the end of the video too what the next part would be. That would be the next endurance race. I mean, yeah, if I could get Jack up, it would have been nice. If we did every part together, but no. We had to ditch this. But I'm pretty sure I will get him up for the last part of this first play. And I keep saying that too many times. Why? Well, my fingers getting tired from pressing on the from for pressing on the right trigger too long. Because this is an old trick. We're lapping so many cars at once. I see so many I see so many cars out together in the trial turn there. Okay, we're about to put a group of cars there. Whoa! Our points double has increased so much, so much. Oh, we pulled down to the yellow line. Three thousand points. We might just get into the way of six thousand, I guess. And I'm not keeping track of how many laps it, uh, of how many laps these cars are. It could be about like two, three, two, or it could be three between five. Because this is a small track, small oval, and just thirty laps of intense racing. And piss strategy would have been nice if I knew. Yeah, piss strategy would have been nice because this game doesn't does not include piss strategy. I'm telling you, New Speed Ship does not have piss strategy at all. And and I don't know why. I mean, Gran Turismo and Forza Motorsport games have piss strategies. That would have been nice to handle. Oh, why, why are we spinning? We just spun out a little bit, and, and I don't know why. Oh, oh, whoa! Man, I almost hit that car. I don't get why the tires were burning. Maybe I just need to do steady stealing so I can so I can control this car easily. Cause that'd be 
Cause that'd be like the Cumio. It looks like this. It looks like the same vinyl on that Mozzarago. Same call, just to say the least. Yeah, that might be like the Cumio. We're finally wrapping the hoe. Going high up and up on the track. Oh, man. Man, we're now over 4,000 profile points. Kill, can we reach our way to 6,000? We could. And can we reach our next travel level? I how is... I... Rolly doubts that we're gonna do this. Rolly means like you have less of a doubt on like do on getting something that you want, like you predict and stuff. That you that you at least we think that's gonna happen. This is kind of has these two wrap these two cars just to be exact. Alright, 10 more laps to go here at Dakota Triangle. Because we're two thirds of the, of the way into this race. Sparks are flying from our cars. Oh, 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 God. I think I spun out that car. Could that be cue me up? Oh. Okay, now we're bumping into things. Now, yeah, I'm spinning out cars. For whatever reason. It was not on purpose, though. It was not intentional. For some reason, I just chucked us guys out. What? They get why they do get me points though. Oh yay, new drive level choir in this race. There's two cars right here. Oh right, yeah, two thousand two about two thousand were more into this race and we just like took two guys out. Just less than a thousand in order to get six thousand points. <laughs> Alright, there's a group of cars ahead of us. Cause we're lap we went crazy. We're lapping cars like crazy. Alright, we didn't spin out that time.
Alright, five six into this race, five more laps to go here at Dakota. Probably this COVID. Alright, just about three hundred more points to get six thousand. And we're about and we're Yeah. Call right there. Yeah. Here we go. Four more laps to go here at Dakota. Yep, we're gonna get success so easily. Hard to get six hours in this lap. Yes, we are. Six thousand points. We got up. We're gonna get all six thousand just one in just one in Dylan's race. Three more laps to go here at Dakota, and this is says it's not coming out to wide here. I pulled away from so many drivers that I, poss I possibly left all of them. To be honest. I possibly left all the drivers because this car is like god to me. We got over 6,000 points and I'm gonna reach the next driver level, so it's gonna take a long time in the full fire screen once this race ends. This was an interesting endurance race so far, more interesting than Ambush Canyon. Was. We are now, yeah, it's great that we're now racing at the trial with track uh, at Dakota. So it should be nice. Alright, here we go. One more lap to go uh, around the Dakota trial with track. Someone might, someone is slowing down right there. Oh, that guy's almost just scraped the wall. There's a couple of cars there. Here we go, off the last turn. I gotta figure out how long we, we have won. Has that uh, S2000? And I'm winning. The Dakota Trioval race 15G for Bronze Collector. We went for 17 minutes and 16.275 seconds. We earned all six stars for this and 80 grand. What an amazing race that we have done. We got a lot of precision points. Over 2,000 for a clean sector and a clean overtake. What do you know? That is nice. That's very nice. Let's just wait for this because we have just acquired a new driver level. Now we had now we advanced. Yeah, we'll have to get a lot more points if we want to reach the next driver level as well. Driver level 21. Very amazing. We'll also level up. Another new invitation event and unlock the flames flying kangaroo. Wow, we have a finally. We're gonna do an invitation event after a while. Complete in endurance event 2. Podium finish in endurance event 2. First place in endurance event 2. Can get the badge, bronze badge for endurance. Man, that was a crazy race. But we get an invitation event to pass up the time. This is gonna be more lengthier than the tw than twenty minutes. Let's see what invitation event we have unlocked this time. A hot lap at Glendale East using a Porsche Cayman S. All right. Right. Let's see what kind of times you can post with the Porsche Cayman S. Uh, close to start here. Couple seconds till start. Just a couple of seconds. 
can drive to sports team as well when Glendale East. Here we go. We gotta be one minute, one minute and two seconds for to get three stars. Oh, and also that reminded me before the temptation popped out that I gotta show you guys the Audi R8 LMS. I didn't show you guys, I didn't show you guys the call once I earned it though, because I was, because I forgot. Yeah. I'm too lazy. I can't do these turns because, yeah, I've had a little bit of a tough time with them. three stars. That's obvious and the wise going to sand. I didn't put that call there. Three stars and 15 grand. At least I have to um wait just for a little bit. Queen Lisa at Grindel is that's it. Alright guys, that'll make, that'll be it for this part, in the next part, we're gonna, huh, we're gonna have a wreck fest here for 3 of the Haze View 8, and stuff, let's see, 3 of the North Strife and 10 of the Spot GP, ooh, those places might be a little bit tough, and I forgot to show you guys, um, hold on, oh, uh, let's go to reward cars, here's the Rocket Tape Formas Saint GT, and here was the Audi O8 LMS in these vinyls and the factory paint. Yeah. So that's the the reward cost reward cost so far. And yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you all have a very good night.